I will beat BC3. I will beat BC3. I don't know. Maybe I just need to get better at dodging. And it wants me to do a tactical build. <laughs> well, me, I want to do anything but that. Shoots an arrow upwards. Critical hit if the enemy's facing you. Cluster grenade. I guess I'll take an ice bow. Sure. I'll take a mushroom boy and we'll recycle this. Not a fan of chicken. That's understandable. Even though I love chicken. All right, what are we doing? We're doing brutality. Brutality will be the way. Brutality will not let me down. We're going to make this a great run. Sure, it started off kind of bad and getting hit, but that's fine. Even the best players get hit sometimes in the face. What came first, the chicken or the egg? That question came first. What does this do? Put critical hits if the victim has less than 40% HP. Maybe we'll take that. Maybe we'll take that. We're beating the shit out of everybody with a frying pan. It's like Team Fortress 2 all over again. We're just gonna play it nice and slow. I haven't had a good run in this game in forever, it seems like, so... I would like a singular good run in Dead Cells. That's all I want. I, I just want a singular good run. Get past the Concierge, even get past the Clock Tower. Just play it nice and simple, you know? All right, we've already made it to the Promenade of the Condemned. actually very well done by me i'm gonna take that one as well because that gets my brutality up by two okay toxic sewers did i miss anything here doesn't look like i missed anything let's go to the promenade of the condemned nice and simple every time i've gone here i've died though so maybe it's not that nice and simple Nice and easy stuff, you know? Nice and easy. That was probably the best start we've ever had. We could take this. 40% damage to a burning target. That's good with our fire grenade. So let's take it over the ice bow. And it does crits if they're less than 40% health. Do you see this? This is what we needed. I'm not going to invest my souls at all. I want to get to the forge. But upgrade it. But upgrade it. Let's go. Um.
We'll get scheme. All right, I'm feeling good. This this is this is a good start. Now we just need to you know not get my ass handed to me again. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. I see what's going on here. No, come on, man. Can you f off? Can you just, can you just leave me alone? Like, is that too much to ask for? Do you just leave me alone? Everything hurts like a tank. Yeah. This game's brutal. Usually, it's not that bad if you're not playing on the BC mode because you get a lot more healing, but... You don't really get any healing in BC, so getting hit once feels like it's the end of the world because you don't want to use your flask up. I get one flask, and that's when I get past the first boss. So I really need to make sure that, like, I don't take too much damage here. And then a bomb just did half my health again. The War Spear increases critical hit chance when you strike the same, then strike several targets at the same time. Sure. I'll take it. Frantic Sword. Looks crew, we have less than 50% health or more than 50% malaise. I definitely will have less than. You can find food to heal, right? There's some areas have shops where you can buy food to heal. Not a lot. And then very rarely do you find food. What up, Diggity Dan? Good morning. How did you know I haven't showered yet? I literally changed my shirt from the shirt I was wearing at the gym because the shirt I was wearing at the gym was the exact same shirt I was wearing yesterday. <laughs> and I was like, uh, I'm just going to change my shirt just in case someone judges me. Just in case someone is being... Just in case someone's keeping track of what I'm wearing. You're wearing a shirt yesterday? Yeah, I'm, I, was, I wasn't shirtless, that's for sure. What up, crit scan? How are you doing? One day I'll post a progress pic on Twitter when I have more confidence. A progress pic of my gym workouts and you guys can be like, whoa, whoa, Nelly. Or you could be like, wow, after all that exercise, only that. Okay, sleeping bear. Is knife dance any good, uh, Petri? You like Schmeet? Who doesn't? Oh, Nelly game nerd. Oh, Nelly. Petri, how did you win BC3? Did you just not get hit, forehead? How did you do it? What, what are the secrets that I'm missing out on? 
<laughs> it's fucking brutal. Powerful poison build. I'm not getting anything powerful at all in my builds as of late. I haven't had like anything that's like, whoa, that's busted. Whoa, that's busting. I do have this spear right now, which is okay. I also looked at dumbbells when you're buying that hula hoop, but they were too heavy for me. My tiny arms, you want small dumbbells for a small person? You probably get some like five pound dumbbells off of like Amazon or something. Did I already go here? I already went here. I'm trying to go to the right side. What up, Davey Gaming? How are you doing, boss? How you doing? What snackies do you got, crit? Dude, how am I? I am doing good. First stream of a new schedule. Where we stream twice a day. We'll see how it goes, you know? Kind of want to get the slicer. Looking forward to it. I'm excited to see how it goes as well. I've been wanting to try it. I've been wanting to try it. A two stream schedule a day again for a little bit. But I was always too afraid to. But. Oh my fucking god. God, I hate these birds. Ah. Ah. I'm going to use one more flask because I don't got a heal here. Where does this take me? More as of the banished. I don't want to go to the banished, to be honest. The bomb bats, those things, they weren't really annoying and on like, you know, no BC, but. They're so annoying now. God. Coffee time? No, no coffee. That was kind of close. Even just trying the 7, the 10 to 11 is good. I find you reach an entire different audience. Yeah, I feel like the nighttime streams have a lot of potential to reach people that I wouldn't be able to hang out with beforehand. Like these morning streams, like the thing about streaming like eight hours in a row is after a few hours, uh, your chat just kind of dies and everyone's just kind of lurking about, which is fine, but, you know, gotta take some chances. It, like, you reach whole new people when you try new times. You never know what could happen. I'm gonna go prison death because I can get a curse here and that means gives me an extra scroll. No coffee and yeah, no coffee, no coffee, no coffee. All natural, baby. I guess I'll upgrade that to plus plus. Sure, I mind. Let's upgrade that to plus plus two. Sure, why not? Melee kills reducing cooldowns will be good as well. You aim for nothing, you'll hit it every time. Oh. Oh. 
I want to grow this stream more. I want to grow the stream more, and, you know... I appreciate everyone that watches, but there hasn't been any growth in a while. Could go for the blood sword. Let's do it. Just upgraded that, but whatever. that thing oh. Oh. does your mother know who I am bitch wait does your mother know who I am manual underscore hung eight manual thanks for the new tier one subscription fuck I died we have manual. Thanks for the tier one. Let's go. A new one. How? Hey, thanks. Enjoy the emotes. Oh my God. It's Taco Bella TV. Hey, Taco Bella. How are you doing? It's been a while. Hey. A new sub that didn't get gifted poggers. <laughs> yeah, hyper poggers. Reveals invisible enemies. Sure. Why not? Okay, maybe I will get a good run finally. I don't know, man. I'm just getting my ass handed to me in this game. I don't want the ice crossbow. This game is just kicking my ass, really. It's just kicking my ass. Life has been super busy, but good. How am I? I am doing good. I'm trying a new stream schedule out today where I stream twice a day again, but I've uh, been honestly just living life, you know? Doing my best. I should use the ice crossbow. The ice crossbow literally only has... Well, I feel like if you use the ice crossbow, you need to have, uh... Oh my god, you need to have good weapons. Because it doesn't seem like it does a lot of damage. Your mother knows who you are because she asked why I had to start... She asked me... She asked me why I had a card telling my stick a finger up my butt. Game nerd, sweetie. Why are you sticking a finger up your butt? Trust me, mom. It's gonna be fine. Well, next time we get the ice cross, but we're gonna need to try it out then. It's got Petri's endorsement. Corrupted power. Dude, this guy is my least favorite thing. That guy is my least favorite in the beginning. My caramba. God. You started your PC clear of an ice crossbow. Ugh. Why well, start in mine with a crowbar? Yeah, I'm clearing it right now. That's called confidence, baby. What up, Lodima? How are you doing? It's like that, uh... 
Jonah Hill meme where it's like, like, hey, no, 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 don't do that. I think that just brings me to the forest area. Uh, I guess we can go over here. Maybe we'll get something. I feel like there might be one more scroll of power here, but there might not be any. Forty percent damage to burning targets. This is actually a good combo because I do more damage to burning targets, and I have the fire brands or the fire bands, whatever the hell they're called. There's actually a secret over here. Good time for some chicken. Let's go promenade again. What up, shark? Shark, we've been here for an hour. Where have you been? All right, I like the start. The weapons are okay. I'll upgrade it to S. 40% damage to a burning target. 80% damage to a poison target. Nobody's getting really... Well, my powerful grenade poisons the enemy, so that actually kind of works. It actually kind of works. We'll get Killer Instinct. You've been being audited by an auditor at work. What does that even mean? I hate the word audit because of the IRS. <laughs> Like, is he making sure you actually work when you're working? Oh my god, shark. Don't get fired. You're gonna see a sleeping bear supporter and be like, oh, okay, this guy's gotta go. So you're not going to get fired. You can't be a full-time sleeping bear mod yet. Is that what you're telling me? Not yet. Oh. Well, that's good. I can't afford a full-time mod. Damage from projectiles reduced by 75% poisons enemies that wound you. Sure. What up, Miss Frost? How are you doing? Hello, hello. Yeah, imagine being like, oh, so what do you do for a living? Oh, I'm a full-time moderator on Twitch TV. Oh, what do you do? Uh, I just chill. <laughs> I just chill, you know? What's up, Alex? Yeah, I'm getting my ass handed to me on BC3. You know, the usual things. How's me? Mies is doing good. First day of a new schedule. We're feeling good, feeling right on a... Whatever the hell today is. Feeling good. We're, we're doing the first stream of the day. And then we got another one. What's up, Carly? How do you apply? You want to be a mod in the Sleeping Bear stream? You want to be a mod in the Sleeping Bear stream? A. Hey. The last time uh, we were doing mod applications for a new mod... One of the applications said, I'll watch when this guy's not streaming. And that guy was always streaming. And I'm like, all right, so they're out. <laughs> Can't really say that. <laughs> I 
I feel pretty good so far, but ask me a week from now how the new schedule is. This morning, I woke up and went to the gym, though, so that was nice. I didn't do 60-pound dumbbells on my uh, chest press, though. I only, I only went up to 50 pounds. But the 50 pounds were still good because I was doing, like, eight reps with them, so I was feeling good. It was all feeling good. Wait, why did I get rid of my fire grenade? I need my fire grenade. Sixty pounds in each hand? Yeah. I was my best is only uh fifty-five pounds in each hand with like five five reps. But I didn't do fifty-five today, I just went up to fifty. Uh, no, I don't do flat bench too often or like the incline because I'm too afraid to because I don't have a spotter. I've been doing pure bench press by itself a little bit more, but since, like I said, I don't have a spotter, I kind of do like very, very lightweight on it because I'm afraid. I'm afraid to ask a random person that I see every day at the gym to spot for me. But just doing the bar by itself, I can bust out, you know, a lot. You love working out? Same. Working out is a great way for me to start my day, personally. You're just benching the bar. Yeah, I can do 50 pound dumbbells in each arm, but I'm doing the bar by itself. Oh my god. <laughs> It sounds so... Like, I wonder if people, like, when they see that, they're like, dude, this guy is doing 50-pound dumbbells for the chest press, and then he's doing the bar by itself. Where's the works on the traps? I was literally working my triceps today, shark! Where the hell have you been? Traps? No. Shark... Shut up. You can do the bar plus 20. Do you have a spotter ever? Because I'm too afraid to do it without a spotter. Because I'm a little baby. Shark, why don't you just move to Canada and come be my gym buddy? Because Cat won't. Cat doesn't want to go to the gym. Which I can understand. So I can have you go to the gym with me instead. It'll be great. You just need a house. You get a house, just get an apartment in this complex, and then I can get us a family membership at the gym. You have a spotter. That's good. Just do your work that you do now uh, at home. Hey, you want to sponsor me to go to Canada job? Even though... We do everything here on site. Trust me, I can do it at home. Oh, you got the assisted one, Carly. The assisted one. Those ones are actually pretty good. My brother hates them. When I first went to the gym with brother, my brother when I was working out at Planet Fitness, he always was like, oh yeah. I'll do that assisted crap, and I'm just like, it's better than nothing. I like doing squats with the assisted bar. Yeah, the Smith machine, I think that's what they're technically called. I, li I like using the, the Smith machine for squats. If I use the Smith machine, the assisted one for squats, I can get up to, I think, 65 pounds on each side for my squats. This is Moderator Shark, also my gym partner. We go to the gym every morning at 7 a.m. That's where you go, Planet Fitness. Hey, Planet Fitness is cheap and exercise is exercise, so... Hell yeah. Planet Fitness is good. It's cheap. Gets a lot of people that uh, can't really afford a gym a la access to a gym. I went to Planet Fitness when I lived in New Hampshire. My gym is a little bit more expensive than Planet Fitness now, but going every single day, I think I reap the benefits pretty well. Because I'm exercising every day. Can't do 
can't scream or anything. I will say, I don't like that about plant. They don't let you do, like, any grunts. Because when you're doing heavy lifting, you kind of, like, just naturally, you're going to grunt a little bit, you know? Like, it's natural to grunt a little bit while you're lifting heavy things and trying to lift it again. I do little grunts all the time. I don't do big grunts. I do little, little tiny baby grunts, you know? Like, uh, uh, uh. like it's heavy. You got if it's heavy. If you're doing heavy lifting, you gotta, you gotta go. Uh, uh, uh. And then you're done. You're like, uh. and then people that have never gone to a gym before look at you like, what the fuck is that guy doing? And then, then everyone else that's gone to a gym is just like, yeah, that's nice. Good job. Tiny grunts are called moans. I moan at the... I guess you could say I moan at the gym. <laughs> I'm a moaner. I was moaning at the gym this morning. Kind of want to try the fire blast. I might like it more than the, uh... It has a wind-up on it, but that could still be pretty good. I'll try it. Show them t your testosterone with my manly voice. Yeah. People will see me, this five, eight and a half guy who's 142 pounds. Hey man, how you doing? Oh, oh. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> While well, lifting the bar. Ooh, ooh. A 35 pound bar being lifted. It was actually very... It was much busier this morning at the gym than I expected for 7.30 a.m. Like, it was much busier than I expected it to be. Like, usually my gym is not that busy early in the morning when I was fast asleep and I heard a little birdie and it went tweet tweet. Now this little birdie had a funny name. It, it was, was. I swear there was a bunch of people I've never seen before. And when I see people I don't, I've never seen before, I'm like, how did you get here? Can you not ruin my life? I'll use one singular class. Away. Oh, what up, Odious? How are you doing? Hope you're well. I'm all for New Year's resolutions, people going to the gym. I just want to see them there more than once. I want to see them there every day, or almost every day. If I see you at the gym, I'm rooting for you. You can do it. Stay at it. Ring fit as a new user. Hey, ring fit's a good exercise if you don't have access to a gym. Ring fit adventure is pretty good. Holy shit. Learn how to juggle for your resolution. I feel like it's easier goal for me than taking care of yourself. You should still take care of yourself. It'll be gone when February rolls around. Yeah, maybe, but you never know. It might stick around. Yeah, how many balls can you juggle right now? What are we looking at? Are you up to three? Three. 
I'm, there's a food shop here. I just need to get to it. And then I can buy a chicken. I don't want to use another flask, though. Thought your internet died. Oh, I forgot to reset my internet. Because yesterday I was dropping frames like crazy. Why not take care of yourself? That's all. That's the age old question. Taking care of yourself feels great. But it's just hard to get the routine going but once the routine is 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 actually happening it feels amazing holy shit balls okay i'm gonna use one more flask just to be safe i'm not a big fan of my crowbar i kind of wish i didn't take this fire breathing God, can you not? <sighs> I'm running it back. You can't stop me. You can't stop me. What up, Mr. Monk? Good morning. Ugh, God, all this crap. Sure. Why not? We'll do survival. We'll do survival. Is that colorless? Huh. Colorless. We get poison on enemies. 80% damage to a poison target. You see, that's nice. Now give me a baseball bat. Now give me a baseball bat. Poisons the enemy. Everything poisons the enemy. You know what I want to do more of that's fun? Jump rope. Jump rope is fun. I saw someone at... I was walking out the gym and I saw someone in like another room doing jump rope. And I was like, oh my god, that looks like so much fun. I want to do that. And I was thinking to myself, does this gym have a jump rope here that I never knew about? Or does this guy bring a jump rope to the gym? This is the guy that has a super fat ass. You got an inflamed knee. Okay, well, maybe I don't want to jump rope. Just give me a baseball bag. Come on, man. Give me a baseball bat. Just give me a baseball bat. That's all I want. Baseball bat. I want the cheesiness of a baseball bat to come into my life and make it easier.
two hours of jump rope. I'm usually at the gym for an hour and a half total with my schedule. Imagine a baseball bat that makes enemies poisoned. Uh, I will drop this nutcracker in a heartbeat. Poison Negan? Lucille? Having a DEA controlled substance at their jobs like you've been having to deal with? What? What the hell are you doing at work? Hey, yo, what are you doing at work? Oh, thank you. Yo, thank you, Dr. Octo Rocket. <laughs> Hope you're doing good. Thank you for the good luck. It's been kicking my ass. It's been kicking my ass. Uh, Chibi, thank you for the lurking for almost three years. That is insane. Holy shit. Three years of almost lurking. Uh, thank you for the continued support. Thank you. Thank you, Chibi. I hope you're doing well. That's a lot of months. And there was also a new sub today. That's crazy. It's crazy. First day of the new schedule, and we already got a new sub. It was in storage for 30 years. Ooh. You finally beat BC1 and you're stuck on two now? That doesn't make me... That makes me feel better that you've been able to... Beat BC too. That's good. Let's go. Keep it going. <laughs> How many hours do you have in dead cells? Also, I'm curious. The new hoop is huge. I've never been able to hula hoop. La la la. It's always something I've wanted to do, but I kind of forgot about hula hoops for a while until you posted one. Hula hoop and so it's a it's one of those little fun activities you do and you're like, oh yeah, this is nice. And then you stop and then you're like, oh, that was nice. I should do it again sometime. I'm in the corner of me getting fuck. I have a good build right now because my Nutcracker does critical hits to frozen enemies. Not as much as I'd like, though. My biggest issue is finding time to play. Yeah, life is busy, eh? Life is busy. But hey, good job on beating BC1. That's still an accomplishment. I'm having trouble getting past BC3 right now, as you can clearly see. I've been I've just been getting my ass handed to me. There was a rave I went to and fell in love with a lady hula hooping, but never got the courage to add, talk to her. talk to him. Hello, I'm new. Hey, Aaron. Welcome to the stream. Your hips are different sizes. Oh my god, why did I read your fucking message about your hips? No, I just got hit. Your hips are different sizes, so you can't move. <laughs> well, as long as they don't lie, that's, that's what matters the most. You've passed 3 BC not long ago. How torturous was it? Because I've been doing 3 BC for probably like... 10 hours now. On and off, of course. 
and it kicks my ass. Explosive crossbow? Shit. Fuck it. Let's do it. Let's have some fun. This be this sick. I love the explosive crossbow. Finally be called to the lamb last night. How'd you like it? Called to the lamb's a good game. It's really hard. I feel like if you want to beat any BC, you need to just have a really broken build. And as much as I like Dead Cells, I've talked about it before and I'll say it some more. Dead Cells. 40% damage. 175% damage to a frozen target. Oh my god, if I still had my goddamn. Oh my god, if I still had my goddamn weapon. Oh my god, if I still had. Oh my god, and I landed. Okay, I'm doing another flight. Oh my god. This had so much potential. 175% damage to a frozen target. What up, Gene? How are you doing? Kind of a little too easy after grinding Hades. I can agree with that. I don't think Call of the Lamb is that hard of a game. I finally got the baseball bat, but I can't make it crit. And then Fatboy Slim had a video contest and an Australian Hooper submitted one. Fatboy Slim? Who the hell is Fatboy Slim? Hey, Phoenix. So far, it feels pretty good. Just one hour earlier. Ask me in a week time and we'll see how I'm feeling. <laughs> Try to focus on tactic builds. They're broken. That's funny. My worst builds have all been tactics builds. My worst builds have all been tactics. My best builds have actually been survival. What's up, Fiona? Good morning. Come on. Thank God. I, I'm not a big fan of tactics either. I like using crossbows, but I just can't seem to get a good build going with them. I wish I could get another one of my frozen weapons. That would be really amazing right now. Shouldn't have freaking recycled it. Ugh. Work in a lab and the safety sheet for the hand soap you got says to use gloves. Use gloves while you're putting on hand soap? I need to get another weapon, man, if I want a good run. It's him. It's the guy, the roguelike guy. Hey, Stray Graves. <laughs> How are you doing? It's me, the roguelike. You're the only one that calls me the roguelike guy. There's a first for everything. But I take it as a compliment. Ah, come on, man. You call me the yuck guy? Oh, God, why would you do that to me? Your YouTube helping find good ones. Hey, thanks for watching the YouTube and thanks for checking out the Twitch stream as well. There's been a good, uh, there's been a small handful of people that have come in from the YouTube stream or from the YouTube videos. 
which is nice. I'm glad to be as a service in helping you find some great games to play. Which ones, if you don't mind me asking, which games have I uh, convinced you to buy? You thought he was the booty guy? No. You're not the beans guy? No. As a roguelike guy, you are now destined to play through 5 BC. That sounds absolutely atrocious. <laughs> Give it enough time, I'd be able to beat it eventually. I would say this could be a good run if I still had the goddamn reason item. I can't remember the name of it. Also, what up, Rely? How are you doing? How are you doing? No mercy mutation. That's a fun mutation to have. Whenever I don't know what to do for a mutation, I always just go like, I guess I'll take no mercy. Guess I'll recycle this. Modem the one gifted Peglin? One Peglin's fun. Peglin's good. They have given it's a good early access game right now. Hello, Dima. Thanks for gifting a sub to Stray Graves. Enjoy the emote, Stray. Congrats on your your, your mother your, know who your, Peglin, I am? your Peglin purchase. Bitch. Lodem the one gifted a tier Thanks one sub to Alex Stormstream. Watching they some dead cells. I'm getting my ass handed to me in this in the these runs. Does your mother know who I am? Why do I keep hearing it's these alerts? Lodem the one gifted a tier one sub to Jenna Palipas from Say 2. Lodema, thanks for gifting subs like crazy! Subs in the channel. I appreciate it, Lodima. Get some love in the chat for Lodima for the gifted subs to Alex, Stray, and Gene. Thanks, Lodima. I greatly appreciate it. Oh, <gasps> it's back! The Frost Blast! Oh! I was about to re roll. Holy moly. So guys, I was thinking on my first break as, uh, you know, we're doing a new stream schedule. I was thinking for the first break, I could watch The Last of Us. Any of you watch The Last of Us Part 1? Or I guess the last, uh, the first episode? I've heard it's very good. People around me have said it's very good. And you know what Curiosity's done besides kill the cat? You been liking Noida? I've never played Noida. But I hear it's very hard. One of the harder games out there. The show? Yeah, the show. It looks pretty good. You enjoyed it, Rhinos? It looks good. Looks good. Man, this is actually a really good run, but I only have one flask. Extra jump. I'll take it. People are hyping it up. The last of us. I mean, let's be honest. Pedro Pascal. And uh, what's the, uh, what's the person that plays Ellie's name? It's Rosie something, right? What's her name? I feel like her name is Rosie. I could be wrong. I am wrong. I'm sorry. Played both games. I've never played a Last of Us game. I know, I know. I want to say Rosie Williams, but I feel like that's wrong. Uh, 
probably should have upgraded this bat. Forgot to. Bella Ramsey. Why did I say Rosie? Oh, I guess Rosie is kind of close to Ramsey. Bella Ramsey and Pedro Pascal. That was kind of close. I wish that the second game ended with revenge. That's all you're saying. No spoilers. And The Last of Us? I've never played it, so I got no clue what you're talking about, but hell yeah. Hell yeah, let's go. Ella Ramsey. It's an interactive movie. God of War felt like a goddamn movie to me at times. Freaking playing God of War Ragnarok felt like it was a goddamn movie. It was good. Ragnarok was good, but... Those single... Those, uh, single-player games... We have a good build, Monk. The baseball bat does 175% extra damage to frozen enemies. Good thing I had that extra jump. Good thing I'm into ramparts as well because I can be able to buy health back. Challenge Rift Found. Oh my god. I'm trying to not heal because... Also, hey, Momo. Uh, oh, my God. 